basically develops your mentality as a coach and how you've unlocked that in the players as a whole or maybe transfer some of your knowledge to them especially as some of the quite younger lads in general yeah I think um that the players are probably tired of it now I have a, a culture slide that I show um and the first thing for me is staff and players everybody puts the team first I think that's that that's that that's huge for me that 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 has to be number one the team so all my decisions when I pick a team it's for what the team I think needs that weekend players in the team are not in the team your attitude behavior has to do what the team needs for the team to be successful so we do a lot on that that's number one is the team then number two is uh the person so i'll treat you like a person i'll communicate to you like a person uh so you know i have four values that for me are really important and that we kind of you know work hard to recruit off as well so players that uh have uh, positive attitudes players that have integrity players that have humility uh, and players that are honest I think they're, they're four key things for us uh, and then after that then it's the professional behaviour so discipline focus intensity bravery openness are five things that we kind of work really hard towards so I run that down the players throats constantly in terms of this is the minimum I expect then if you make mistakes off of that no worries I'll coach you the staff will coach you to get better and we do that in a variety of ways whether it's individual whether it's unit whether it's team uh, that's on pitch, off pitch, video, animations, tactics boards, just sitting down, having a chat, showing them best practice from the Premier League. It, we do it in you know, numerous ways to try and sort of educate the players. And also then we're patient. I think that's the biggest challenge, I think, when you go into first team football is results have to happen instantly, yet development takes time. So it's finding that, that balance and that sweet spot of how do we... How do we be a little bit patient, but also drive a standard and know that we need to win games? 